don't know if you've heard of that fog crawler that old Longfellow's been hunting, but we think she might be somewhere nearby. He calls her Shipbreaker. Been tracking her for years, but so far she's been too wily to catch. I've never heard of this Shipbreaker. Haven't heard of her yet? The biggest and meanest fog crawler on the island. Wiliest one, too. He calls her Shipbreaker. Been tracking her for years, but so far she's been too wily to catch. Just tell me how to find this Shipbreaker, and I'll take care of her. Well, it may not be as simple as all that. Old Longfellow's been tracking this beast for years, and he's never gotten her yet. Maybe you'll have more luck. At least he's figured out a way to tell when she's in the neighborhood. If you tune the radio on that fancy pit boy of yours to the right frequency, you'll pick up a strange squealing sound when she's nearby. Longfellow says it has something to do with the radiation she gives off after so many years in the fog. You may want to talk to old Longfellow himself if you're serious about tracking down this monster.
no chance against the crawlers. I hear that you've been trying for years to track down an ancient fog crawler. That's right. Shipbreaker, I call her. A wily old beast. I've put all the harbormen on the lookout for her. I took care of Shipbreaker for you. Did you now? That's damned impressive. Especially for a mainlander. Funny thing is, happy as I am that she's gone, I think I'm gonna miss her in a way. Walking in the fog will be a bit less interesting now. But I don't have to wonder if she might be lurking behind the next rock. Kept me on my toes, she did. For that, I'm grateful, in spite of the sorrow she visited on the island. Here, you may as well have my trusty old harpoon gun. I was saving it for delivering the killing blow to Shipbreaker. But now you should have it. Excuse me. We heading out? I just need to 